What is up everybody? Welcome back to Dad Does Videos. Today I'm coming at you from my garage where I wanted to show you how to connect a new garage door remote to your opener that maybe is 10, 15, 20 years old. Sometimes your remotes go bad, they go missing, you buy a house, the person doesn't know where the remote is anymore. So it's pretty easy to just pick one up for 15, 20 bucks off of Amazon and connect it to your opener. Let's see how you go through the process. All right, so just to give you a bit of an idea of what we're dealing with here, our opener is an overhead door brand. It is probably 22, 23 years old. That's how old the house is. We bought the house about 10 years ago, so I'm assuming it's the original one that was installed. It is called the Python. The remote I bought is this overhead door model OCD TR dash 3BX. It is supposed to work with this model that we have. So we'll see what happens. Let's get into it. Okay, first step, and this is gonna sound silly, but you wanna put that battery in. And if you bought the same product that I did, the battery comes with it. If you did not, it is a 23A. Here's the product. We just take this battery door off slide up just like that, put our battery in, just like that, and we put that door back on. Okay, next thing you want to do is get a little ladder and climb up to where your opener is, as you can see the Python right here, and then find the learn code button on your opener. Now for some, that learn code button is in the back. For mine and for others, it's underneath this light shade. So uh, you may have screws and probably should have screws to hold this on, but the owner before me, for whatever reason, did not have them and I've never put them back. But if you do have the screws, unscrew them and then just slightly pull down on the tabs and that reveals the light bulb and then you'll see here kind of the key right here to all these buttons and knobs. Learn code right there. That is the learn code button. All right, so once you found that learn code button, we're gonna head, go ahead and push it. Make sure re your remote is near you because you are going to need that. So you can see it's ready to receive some programming because that light is blinking. We're gonna grab our remote and I'm going to press this button furthest down because our man, our uh, opener is so old as you can see the light lit up we just have to press that same button again within 30 seconds to program it light went off and then is blinking rapidly as you can see here and now goes off so in theory we should be programmed let's try it there goes the garage door we are good to go, people. I'm gonna hit that button again, and it should go back up. That's it, thanks for joining everybody.